Welcome back to EA Sports. He's Ray Ferraro. I'm James Sabalski. Moments away before they drop the puck on this one. A few things you're looking forward to. Always goaltending. Always so critical. You know special teams will play a big part in this contest as well. There's really nothing insignificant between these two teams. Both teams lined up in the middle. We are ready to get things underway. And this one is officially underway with the puck dropped. Takes the feed and makes the save. James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro with you here in the early going of this period. Still looking for our first goal. Calgary's won the faceoff. And the puck leaves the zone. Montreal's ready to go on the attack. And now he tries to get it across to Dickinson. Up along the wall on the right side and into the attacking area. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. He scores! They're on the board in this one. Yeah, it looks like one team came ready to play. The other one's still feeling their way in. Well, they'll feel their way now. They're down one. Moore's won the draw. Hammers it on net, denies him, he got all of it. Oh, he almost put him through the boards. Oh, he looks like he's banged up there. He's gonna try and finish the shift, but he's pretty clearly not at 100%. Sends it over to Moore. Nice zone entry from the middle. To his teammate, he scores and tied it up. Brand new game, all that work that's gone behind this. And we're back to even Steven. Inching closer to the midway mark of the period. We got a tie game. Montreal's won it. At center ice now. He grabs the puck. Calgary's on the attack. Right, Devastating collision. Now you got the lead. Don't sit back. Get right back to the face off and try and attack again. The flag's in your favorite position, Ray, up ahead. That's the best place to play the game. You can control the pace and be confident with your plays. From one point man to another. Moves it quickly over to Dickinson. Here he is in front. Whoa. He scores! The captain leading by example. Puck possession so critical. Another faceoff coming up here. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. And here's the pass to McDonald. And the linesman calls icing on the play.
Montreal's won the draw. Oh, he digs in and wins the draw there. Now they can get out of the zone. Wax it into the offensive zone. Calgary's got a hold of it along the wall. Montreal's got control of it now here in the offensive end. And as he opts to freeze the puck, we get a whistle. Starting to look like a little bit of a fire drill in the zone, so this is a good play. Past the midway mark of the frame, James and Ray with you tonight. We are all tied up in this one. Calgary's got a hold of the puck. Picked up along the boards by Giordano. Calgary's playing it from the side. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. Quick pass across to Dickinson. Sends the pass over. And he comes up with it. Scooped up along the wall by Moore. Puck grabbed by Giordano. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Regains possession at center. And we've got a two-on-one. Montreal's got the puck. Look at the Savardian spinorama. Jostling for the puck, and he loses control. The Flames get a hold of it. Montreal's got a hold of it against the wall. Cutting to the front of the net. Here's a chance on the doorstep. Scores! The go-ahead goal! Uh, this game has been tight. Now somebody's got a leg up. Montreal's been preaching better starts. They've got that with a one-goal lead, Ray. They've got the lead. It's in the first period. There's lots of game left, but their coaches are talking about staying on the front foot to be aggressive. Icing is called, stopping the play dead. Here in the late goings of the period, Montreal's been the better-looking team over the last few minutes. They'd love to build on this one-goal lead. Calgary's got it in the offensive zone. They'll be back on their heels. They lose the draw after they've iced the puck. They're a little tired. Handles the puck. Moore's dangerous in the offensive zone. He's got it now, and he's already got the go-ahead goal. And they can't convert to the play. And now it's grabbed by McDonald. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. Denied by the goaltender. Handles the pass from his goalie. Twenty minutes in the books, and almost as many goals scored there. It felt like what a period. And as both teams head to their respective rooms. Two more periods still to come. We're looking forward to it here on EA Sports. Well, the first 20 is in the books. Let's see what this second period offers. Well, after an intriguing opening period, here we go. It's period number two. Puck is dropped, and we are underway. There's the whistle icing the call. Lots of time left in this period. 3-2 is where we sit in what has been a tightly contested affair. Taken by Giordano. Takes the feed. Hammers it! They score! We are tied! I like the way they've gone about these games. They've kept working away, not taking too many chances, and their work has resulted in a tie game. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. Calgary's grabbed a hold of the puck. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. And he takes a shot! Big time stop there! I think it's a chance for a breather here as he hangs on and covers the puck up. Who, for the players or for you? Well, you know, I won't complain. Calgary's won the draw and they'll go to work. 
And he gets in the lane to block that. Montreal's gained possession along the boards. Couldn't complete the play. Regains control here in the neutral zone. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Smart defensive play there. Montreal's got the puck along the boards. And that's broken up with a stick in front. Calgary's on the attack. Right to the middle. Takes a shot. And he makes the save. More than half the period left to play. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Montreal's got possession here in their own end. Feeds it on over to Moore. Moves it around along the half wall. He says let's get physical on that play. Dickinson's got control of it now behind the cage. And it's a quick pass to Moore. And that one's broken up. Moving into the attacking zone. The Flames take it along the wall. Centered out in front. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. And now he moves it to Dickinson. Dishes it to McDonald. And now it's over to Moore. Picked off in the open ice. He grabs the puck here at the point. Cops off to hang on to it to get a whistle. You start to wear down a little bit, you need your goalie to help you out. More than half the frame has been played here. You can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. Puck scooped up by Dickinson. Pushes it across to Moore. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Slides the puck down low. Moore's got it deep in the offensive end. The Flames scoop it up along the boards. Spruce gains the zone. Slides it diagonally to Dickinson. Can't get a hold of that pass. Puck picked up by McDonald. Went for the dirty dangle and it goes sideways. He's got good hands, but I think he overdoes it a bit here. Now he doesn't have the puck anymore. Uh-uh! Nice block. Angles it over to McDonald. And that one's picked off in the neutral zone. Calgary's got the puck along the wall. And that's blocked. Calgary's got the puck against the half wall. Oh, and a misfire as that goes right out of the zone. Cuts to the front. Stopped by the goaltender. In the final moments of this period, it's all tied up. Approaching the final 60 seconds here in the second. They've got numbers. It's a two-on-one. They score! Really good play at the net. And now somebody's got a lead. And we'll see if they can increase it. Calgary's gone up by one here late in the second. Really good effort to get themselves into the lead. Now you want to carry it right to the intermission. Moves it to McDonald. And that one's blocked. Here's a block. Tracks it perfectly in the offensive end. Well, not exactly a banner night for the goaltenders as the second period comes to an end. At least they'll get a breather here. Both teams seem fresh after that second intermission. We're ready to drop the puck on period number three. 
Well, let's see what this third period can offer at what has been a score fest thus far. Ray, with two periods in the books, what are your thoughts on the game to this point? Montreal's got to find some energy here. The game's close, but they haven't had very many shots on goal. You're not going to score like that. Directed over to Moore. Montreal's trying to make something happen in the offensive zone. And that one's broken up. Great block there. Here's an odd man rush. Breakaway. What a stop on the breakaway. He waits for the first move, lets the shooter make it, and then shuts it down. Receives the pass. All alone. Referee. There's the whistle, and we've got a penalty shot being called here. Pretty easy call, I think, James. He's out clear, and he gets tripped up. Funny, coaches always tell you, get your stick on the puck. And then when you try and the guy trips up, they tell you, get your stick up. He scores! He's coming up! He's coming up! Shows a lot of poise. When you get out there by yourself, your heart speeds up, but you still have to stay calm. He does it perfectly. This neutral zone face-off set to go, and we are back underway. Here they come on the attack. Sends it across. Scores! I smell a silly! Calgary's got the one goal lead here in this third period. What's the strategy now in your mind, Coach? I don't think you change at all. I, I also don't know in today's game how you defend or be conservative. You're just inviting trouble to do that. Moves the puck along the half wall. And makes the save. Nearing the midway mark of the period. The Flames are hanging on to this one goal lead. They'd love to add another. The Chislers get a hold of the puck in their own end. Quick pass to McDonald. Moves the puck. Set it out in front. Can't connect. The Flames have a hold of it in the defensive zone. He's got a step. Give them to us, and you're like, what am I going to do? I'm not wearing somebody else's hat. Montreal's got a hold of the puck off the draw. Fires away! Oh, just wide. He didn't miss that by much. He got lots on it. Here's a chance! Comes up with the stop. Simmons generally plays a much more solid game than this. That was a good stop. I liked it. However, he's lucky that his team has found the offensive side of their game tonight. Huge play in his own end to come up with the puck. Steps inside. Quick feed to McDonald. Oh, you'll win respect for your teammates doing that. What a block. Moves right to the middle. Oh, a clutch save. Hawk challenges and makes a save on a dangerous scoring chance. He scores! This might be it. Where were you voting for so many of these fans? And again, he gets a chance on goal, and he makes no mistake about it. The Flames have been enjoying Pat. The stat night here has been going all night long here, even in the third. They came to play tonight. They have not let their opponent breathe, and it has been a dominating performance. On the attack along the boards. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Dickinson's got it into offensive territory. The Chislers will take it behind the net, and they can't connect. And the puck escapes the zone, and they'll be forced to tag up. Strong defensive effort, and he regains control of the puck. A chance in front. Referee stops the play. We've got a penalty shot on the way. Fishing around for the puck. He gets his stick into the player's feet, and this becomes an easy call. Spruce is ready for his penalty shot. Comes up with a huge stop. He was right on the move there. Man, he read the shooter like a children's book. No problem. Calgary's up big time here in the late stages of this third period. Moore's won a big draw on their own end. Nice feed at center. Moves up ahead now. Centering pass! And that one's broken up. Montreal's got possession here in the offensive zone. Stop that one. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. Calgary's regained possession of the puck. Stops him cold. Off target. 
Montreal's got the puck along the wall. Right in front, and there's the save. Blocked in traffic. Calgary's got the puck inside the defensive zone. With possession along the wall. Takes a bump, but still hangs on to the puck. And he rings the post! Calgary's bench is a little bit frustrated. They've had a number of pucks bounce off the posts and stay out. It would be nice to add to the lead once in a while. You're dealing with checkers, you're dealing with the line matchup, and it doesn't matter where you are, three is a great night. Puck grab by Dickinson. From the point, looks to make something happen. Calgary's looking to break out of their own end. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. Centered out in front. Quick snap. Gives them nothing in front. Final horn is sounded, bringing this one to an end. Calgary's offense is the difference tonight, Ray. Close game, not much to choose between the teams, but if there was a difference, it was that they shot the puck more, they got it back more, they delivered more chances on goal.
stomach to disappoint you i know the trouble that you must go to it's from a place you can barely imagine far from the crowd and the ambulances at my best i've almost been It's a hot ticket tonight, and we here at EA Sports are so excited to bring it to you. Along with Ray Ferraro, my name is James Sabalski. Let's get ready to play this one. Dupuis is one of those guys who's an attraction selling tickets for this one, Ray. Dangerous offensive player. He can skate and shoot the puck. Any team would be lucky to have him. Yeah, you, know, you can just feel the buzz of this city all day long, and we are seconds away now for this opening faceoff. Well, the hype for this one has been off the hook. Puck is dropped. Let's see if this one actually lives up to it. Boston's got it in their own zone. Passes it over to King. Boston's got the puck against the boards. He was locked in there. Spruik scoops it up here inside the defensive zone. Drives it to the crease. zone. Moves it quickly over to Downey. Sends the pass down low. The Grizzlies have it from their own end. Delayed penalty coming up and he'll go to center ice for the penalty shot. He's going to look up at the big board and see that. You know what? That's a trip for sure. He got a stick in the wrong spot. Tripped up the player. Makes the stop under pressure. Shooter didn't get done what he wanted to. He wanted to open the goalie up, but the goalie stays square and makes the stop. Still plenty of time left in this frame. Calgary's up one zip. Here he is, shot right in front. Couldn't light the lamp on that. What a chance. Sometimes the puck just doesn't go where you want to finish it. He makes a good... He scores! Well, I like the way they stayed aggressive here, James, after scoring once. They didn't just settle the game down. They went after it again. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period. Calgary's got a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. Nice stick work to knock the puck loose. And that's just out of reach. 
And he handles the cross ice pass. Nice zone entry on the left side. Keeps hold of the puck. And he can't get it off. Centering pass. Here he is on the backhand. And he denied that opportunity. Smothered that in close chance. Play set to resume with the faceoff ready to go. Puck is dropped and we are back underway. The Grizzlies take it across the line. Here's the chance. Scores! The defender put it into his own net. Boston's cut the lead to one. They're back at center ice and ready to get back into this thing. My favorite part about this is the coaches on both benches are going to be pulling their hair out. I like goals. <laughs> they don't. Love offense. Let's do it. Oh, smart heads up read. The Grizzlies gain possession in their own end. Strong defensive effort. Calgary's got a hold of it along the wall. And the puck leaves the offensive zone. They'll be forced to tag up. Takes the pass. Here's a shot. Glove save, and he made it look simple. James and Ray with you tonight. More than half the period has been played. Boston's shown a new energy over these last few minutes. They got one back, but they still need one more in order to tie. Aaron pass, and the play's broken up. Great use of the body to knock him off the puck. They gain the offensive zone from the middle. Boston's got a hold of it against the wall. Ali swooping in on the attack. Gets control of the puck here in his own end. Boston's got it along the wall. Unable to reach that one. Here's a short pass to Fitz. Nice pass. Moves the puck into the attacking area. And here's a chance with a penalty shot on the way. Soon as the hands go up when they start to bleed with the ref, you know they know they're guilty. Spruce has got the puck, and here he comes. confused with somebody with a lot of thoughts in his head. I thought he was pretty clear-minded when he went in there. He made a simple move and scored. Here in the lane going to the frame. The Flames are up 3-1. Good read by the winger as the two setters tie up. Let's it go! Makes the save! The setters will glide into the dot. Boston's won the faceoff. Moves it to King. Puts it on goal. Spruce carries the puck in his own zone. Coughs it up at center. Here they come, three of them. Slides it across. What a great read, breaking up the pass. Break away. Misses the net. Really good opportunity. The shooter's going to kick himself in the pants for that. Levels him with the hit. And with the sound of the horn, that brings some finality to the opening period, and we've got a close one. We'll do the same and get ready for period number two.
Both teams back on the ice after the first intermission. Ray Ferraro, James Sabalski ready to bring in the call for period number two. Here we go, middle frame now underway as the puck drops. Ray, what's your assessment of the game to this point? Calgary's got the lead in a game that's had all kinds of chances, in particular because they've had the majority of shots on goal. All alone! And that fizzles out. I'm not sure what his intention was going to be there. Scores! All on a one-timer by Marion! Calgary's offense firing on all cylinders tonight. Is that fair to say? Yeah, they're going to have to change the netting in that other goal. Man, they are <laughs> firing the puck in there at will. It's getting frayed. We'll just And he'll get a chance with a penalty shot. Well, that's going to be a penalty. They're going to have to call that. Trying to get to the puck, he reaches his stick right into the guy's feet, and down he goes. Down, he's ready for the penalty shot. Scores! <laughs> Lots of pressure on the shooter. He makes an excellent play and beats the goaltender. The Flames have dominated them thus far and continue to do so here in this second. There's the collision. The Grizzlies will play it from the defensive zone. Oh, he'd like to have that pass back. Calgary's got it in the offensive zone. The Flames have it against the wall. Here's the chance to set up now. And they fail to go tape to tape. And that's picked off in front. He'll keep it alive and moves it ahead. They've got the defense outnumbered. Rocks him. Trying to shake the defender. All alone. Denies him on the breakaway. The Flames scoop it up along the boards. Here's a chance. Off the glove. Delayed penalty looming. Referee stops the play. We've got a penalty shot on the way. He's got to keep his feet moving so he doesn't get called for interference. And here we go. He scores his hat trick on the night. Uh, what a great night for him. He's had some chances. He's capitalized three times now. And on the road, it feels really good. Boston's won the draw. Looking to set up offensively. Sends it over. Big hit on the play. He's not missed many of these. Every time he gets the puck, they seem to target him. And he's not been able to elude anybody. Trying to dump it out. And the linesman calls icing on the play. The Flames have been on fire offensively tonight. And they lead for good reason here in the second. Offense is on face off and he wins the draw. Win the draw after the icing. You possess the puck while they're running around a little bit tired. It's a two-on-one. And sends it just out of reach. Here's a shot. And puts it right over the crossbar. And puts it off the crossbar. Had the goalie beat up high, but not the bar. Calgary's done a nice job of generating pucks on net. And as a result, they lead here in the second. Boston's won the draw. Ali's lugging the puck. And look at this, a three-on-one. He scores! That gives them some hope, maybe, kind of, sort of. They've really given up a ton of goals tonight. Boston's back to center ice. What's the message here? Because there's still a long way to go. I don't think anybody looks too far ahead. They just, you got one goal, try and get another. Try and get yourself within shouting distance. Picks up the puck in his own end. The Flames have it in the offensive end. Quick pass to Fitz. Nothing doing on that. Boston's got the puck in their own end. They've got numbers. Here's the pass. And that's broken up. The Flames have it now. And the puck skips out of the zone. They'll have to regroup. Fitz has got it now deep inside his own end. Takes it at center. To his teammate. He got to be happy with where their game is at so far tonight as they continue to lead big here late in the second. And skilled use of the stick to poke the puck away. Ali's got it along the wing. Pass right on the doorstep. And that one's broken up. Steps into the offensive end. 
Move to the middle, and they can't finish that one. Oh, he's going to be kicking himself for that. The play was there. He just doesn't execute that last pass for the scoring opportunity. Oh, boy. Here comes a three-on-one. Stopped by the goaltender. Floyd's fought that puck all night long. He makes a good save there, James, but it's been a long night for him, and the guys in front of him haven't been much better. There's the horn ending period number two. I'm not sure they wanted it to end. Alongside Ray Ferraro between the benches, I'm James Sabalski, ready to bring you period number three. Well, this has been an absolute blowout through the first two periods as we get underway here in the third. Ray Ferraro is back down at ice level. Ray, 40 minutes played so far. What's been your assessment of this tilt? The Grizzlies are in the position they deserve right now, James. They're behind in the game. He scores! Well, the old double dip makes this a fantastic night for you. You know it's your night. You're feeling it. And now he's got two. Calgary's on total cruise control early in this third period. Puck picked up in the open ice. Move to the middle. Just can't complete that pass. Oh, he's got the right play in mind. He just doesn't. Oh, that's going to be a penalty. And there it is. Penalty shot the call. I guess it's a little bit of bad luck, James. I mean, he's reaching for the puck. He's in. Position to try and keep the play moving, but he trips him up. He scores! That's the hat trick! Now, oh, what a great feeling to get three goals in a game. Doing it on the road is a, is a real nice trick. Boston's won the draw in the neutral zone. Here's a chance, a two-on-one. Backhand with intention. Scores! The answer right back. That's a heck of a response. Give one up. You want to try and get it back as quickly as possible. I'm loving the way they attacked on this rush here, James. Once they realized they had the extra man, they moved the puck quickly and the defenders just can't keep up. The Flames lead this one early in the third period. They have been the more aggressive team offensively with the lead in the shot department. Vajahula, he's won the draw here in the open ice. And we'll get a face-off as the puck goes out of play. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. Face-off here in the neutral zone, and we are back underway. Couldn't catch up to that pass. The Grizzlies have a hold of it in the defensive zone. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. Boston's won it. He's got a step. Between his legs. He scores! What a finish! You get a chance like this, they don't come very often. You better put it away, and he does beautifully. Two. Plenty of quality scoring opportunities, and they lead it big time early in the third. There's the whistle from the linesman calling it offside. Calgary's offense has been the story tonight, leading big time here in this third period. Gets a hold of the puck. Into the offensive zone. Backhander in front. He scores! Sometimes it's just your night. He's got his second goal of the game is a good evening for him. Boston's back at center ice. They have a long way to go still here, though, Ray. Yeah, get your scorers out there, James. Don't worry about the defensive end of the ice. You need goals. They go on the attack through center. Pumped off the puck. Coming down the left wing and into the zone. Can't catch up to the pass. Ref, there's the whistle, and we've got a penalty shot being called here. Tripped up on the breakaway. The ref makes the right call in signaling for a penalty shot. 
His stick gets in between his feet, and when the player goes down, the penalty's going to be called. You got to finish him off. The chances are there, but you still got to put him away. It's a great play, and now we can celebrate his three-goal night. Now, would you ever wear one of those chapeaus? Not on a the chance. Ice? Would you wear someone else's hat? Absolutely not. Quickly, two goals in right around 90 seconds. Wow, insane how quick that was. Bang, bang. Yeah, the defending team just couldn't put a stake in the ground. They couldn't stop them. From center, they get into the attacking area. From the slot, fires away. Gets a pad on it to deny him. Floyd save right there is an excellent one. Now a quick pass to Downey. Trying to gain a step. Skates to the crease. Denies him. Oh, excellent stop by the goaltender. He read that perfectly. Calgary's been the better team tonight. They have turned good defense into solid offense, and they lead here in the third. Fitz has won the draw deep in the defensive zone. Trying to shake loose for point play. Scores! Wow, what a goal! Nice hand, great finish. No short break and it's in the net. The Flames have been ripping their opponents all night long, and it continues here in the third. This has been as good a performance as you can possibly imagine. There's really nothing to say behind their bench right now. Makes a move in front. Calgary's gained possession along the boards. Officials say play on. That's only because of the effort to get down the ice. It's in. He scores. There's another one that's two goals in just under two minutes. I think we can officially call this one a route now. Yeah, this is a steamroll. This is over. Calgary's won the draw, and they take possession here in the open ice. They've got the defense outnumbered. Hammers a shot. He scores again.
You know I fear commitment Or do I really DM me, call me, I'm here to listen I was in London, be bumping up at the sound check You say your life's a movie, you ain't left your town yet My only bag is Louie, I got your back like Chewy But now I'm solo, we don't have to chat about it, do we? I'm getting dope, but we got a special, yes I know That's let it grow, that's the M-I, double S-I-O Back in the game, I'm traveling Back in the van, unraveling Capital gain, I dabble in Cashing in or cashing out, rap performing, got me passing out, has it rain come Hi everyone, he's Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabalski. Welcome to our EA Sports Showdown here tonight. Let's send it down to Ray Ferraro, who was between both benches ringside, Ray. I want to see tonight, James, who's gonna be able to take care of the puck. Both teams have been plagued by turnovers of late. They turn the puck over, they make themselves defend way more often than need be. The officials there at center, and I think we are about to get this one underway. Been fired up for this one. The puck is dropped. Let's go. And now he moves it quickly to Downey. Made the stop on the play. Nice zone entry from the right side. Maintains possession. With the back hit. Stopped by the goaltender. But he came out and challenged him. Good save. Lots of time left in this period. Still looking for our first goal. Locks them up on the draw as they take possession. And that slides right out to center ice. 
Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Here's a chance right in the slot. Gets in front of it. Looks to set up along the point. And uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. Montreal's looking to break out. Calgary's got the puck along the boards. Here's an odd man rush. Sends it across. From point blank. Scores! I smell a silly. Calgary's weathered the storm here, and they've taken a 1-0 lead. Always better to play from the right. They'll want to expand this lead as quickly as they can. The Stingers move the puck in the defensive zone. Nice feed from the left side up the middle. Here's a chance to make something happen inside the neutral zone. Puts it up front. Sends a pass over. Denies him with a save. Sends it quickly to Fitz. Can't get a hold of that pass. And just a total scores! The second of the night. Well, things go well for you if you score multiple times in a game. This has been a terrific night for him. We haven't even hit the midway mark in a period. The Flames have recently taken a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. From his own end, he picks up the puck. Here's a chance. Tries to the crease. And that's the to give them to us and you're like what am I going to do I'm not wearing somebody else's hat <laughs> down he's got the puck now in his own end here they are on the attack we got a penalty coming up on the play as the referee scores you might put the first goal he's in the other net there that's four in a row for him more than half the frame has been played here Calgary's latest goal has now given them a four goal lead while the centers are jammed up, nice job by the winger to steal the puck. He scores! He can't miss tonight! Unbelievable to get this many chances, but to be able to put the ball away. Calgary's been the better team here in this first period, and as a result, they've got a big lead. And with the two centers tangled up, the winger skates away with it. Slides the puck over. Backhander turns it away. Montreal's got a hold of the puck. Slides it over to King. That's taken away. Great defensive effort there. Jostles the puck loose. The Flames gain control of it. Bringing the physicality tonight. Montreal's got the puck. Break away. Big time save. Advantage goalie on this one. Sometimes the goalie takes the advantage by keeping really still. Don't make the first move. He did it perfectly. Quick feed to King. Montreal's got it across the line. Delet and here's a chance with a penalty shot on the way. It's funny. Coaches always tell you, get your stick on the puck. And then when you try and the guy trips up, they tell you, get your stick out of there. You're kind of stuck. Score! You go in on the penalty shot, you've got to be decisive. You're looking at the goalie trying to lead him, but you have to have a really good idea what you want to accomplish. In the final moments of this period, Montreal's on the comeback trail, even though it's a long road. The Stingers take possession here in the open ice, and that's just out of reach. <laughs> The Flames looking against the half wall. Pokes it away in his own end. Well, there's the horn. 20 minutes in the books. I think one team's still trying to figure out what happened. into the second period.
Welcome back, everyone. He's Ray. I'm James. Second period set to go. Great start for one side and disaster for the other. What does period number two offer? Let's find out as we're underway here. Well, we've got over 20 minutes, and they're awarding a penalty shot here. Tripped up on the play while he's in the clear. The penalty shot is the right call. Fishing around for the puck, he gets his stick into the player's feet, and this becomes an easy call. And he makes a pay as he scores on the penalty shot. Slick move, really good patience. Goaltender really doesn't have a chance after he bites on that first move. Calgary's on cruise control now, is that fair to say? It is, and it looks like they're going to try and get another couple of goals here. They're not letting down at all. Was he just stealing the Kuznetsov goal celebration? Isn't that supposed to be like the greatest form of flattery? You, you Imitation? Steal, yeah, yeah, you steal somebody else's thing. It's too I don't soon. Really, yeah, I don't know, but have some fun. You scored a goal. Play set to resume with the face-off ready to go. And they take possession. Nice job tangling him up on the draw. And that pass goes awry. One on one with the goaltender. Here we go. Denies him on the breakaway. Really good speed to get out in front. Dust the pack. Now it's him and the goalie. But the goalie's better. He makes the stop. Takes the feed. Stops him with a glove. Simmons makes the save. And I think the biggest problem a goalie has with a big lead is how do I stay in the game? He hasn't had much to do. You've got to stay sharp yourself. Fitz has won a big draw on their own end. Calgary's moving it along the wing. They've got numbers. Driving right to the front. He scores! This might be a where were you moment for so many of these fans. And again, he gets a chance on goal, and he makes no mistake about it. The Flames don't want to change anything here. This has been outstanding for them tonight. Moves it quickly over to Jonas. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. Rocked him in the open ice. Centering pass. Oh, that's a good hit. And that's turned aside by Simmons. Couldn't connect on that pass. Moves the puck down low. Oh, they telegraph the pass and he picks it off. Calgary's there he is. He's got a step. Nothing doing. Tried to make the perfect shot. Doesn't execute it. Oh, there's going to be a penalty on this play here, James. Fitz has got the puck. Rocks him awesome on the play. He got all of that one. Takes control of the puck. Solid hit on that play. Over. And he'll go to center ice for the penalty shot. A little too aggressive with a player that doesn't have the puck. He gets whistled for interference. Fitz is ready to go one-on-one -on -one with the goalie. Wins the irony was that close, Ray. So frustrating. You beat the goaltender and you don't get anything. The centermen glide into position. Fences won the draw. Along the half wall with the puck. Uses the force on that hit. Scores! This is getting insane. It is crazy how often the puck tonight to end up on his stick, and then when it's on his stick, it ends up in the net net. What a game. That's a smart read with the two centermen tied up. Sends the pass over. Here's a shot, and the lane's clogged up, blocking that. The Stingers gain possession along the wall. Kamaratz is setting up against the wall. Centering pass. The Flames will play it in their own end. And that pass is stolen. Shuts him down. Really good puck control by the goalie as he gets it out of danger. This shift continues on in the offensive zone. Great work. Grabs the puck and looks to make something happen. Montreal's got it now. Here he is, wrists it on net. Stones him in front.
swoops in off the wing to grab the trying to gain a step to the low slot. Oh. Oh. Pretty deceptive move here. Short on the breakaway, he makes no mistake. Calgary's been pounding them all over the ice tonight. Ray, what's been your assessment? Physically, skating, skill, they've been the better team in any category you want. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Calgary's got a hold of it along the wall. Lowers the boom with that hit. Here's a chance. He scores! It's in! And that's three, Ray! I think he's the most surprised guy in the building. Look at the way he reacted when that puck went into the net. Outstanding effort. A quick flick of the wrist, and that snapshot beats the goaltender. He's in the low slot. He doesn't have much time to think about it. The Stingers get a hold of the puck off the draw. Well, the ice has sure looked tilted after 40 minutes of play as the second period comes to an end. Here we go, a big third period set to go. Ray Ferraro, James Sobalski bringing you all the action. Grabs the puck in the defensive zone. Can't maintain possession after that hit. Takes it to the front. The backhander scores! Finally! Yeah, James, for the first time in a while, there's a little life on their bench. Maybe this can turn the tide a little bit. Montreal's got to be thinking more and more offense here now in the third. No reason to sit back. You're in a hole here. You need goals and you need lots of them. Attack. Grabs the puck at center. The Stingers. There's the whistle. And we got a penalty shot coming up. Referee's got his hand up, signaling a delayed penalty. He wants to clear just a little bit of room, but he ends up getting in the way too much and he gets called for interference. Huge stop right there. Shuts it down. Take that stuff away from here. Calgary's on total cruise control early in this third period. Fitz has won the draw here in the offensive zone. Down, he's got it against the boards. Nothing doing on that. Trying to shake the defender. All alone. Book it up. Takes the bump and loses control of the puck. Hard hit on the play. Wow, did he ever finish him hard. And when he dropped... He also dropped his stick. Now he's got to collect himself. Looks like a yard sale out there. Vince has got the puck in his own zone. Calgary's got it from behind their own net. Slides the puck ahead into the neutral zone. Here he is in close. And he puts that one aside with ease. Through the middle of the ice. They have all alone. Move to the middle. Oh, what a stop. Goaltender comes up big in good position to make the save. Couldn't complete the play. Passed up ahead and tries to make a diagonal pass to Jonas. Puck exits the zone. Calgary's got a hold of it against the wall. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Handles the pass at center. Moves into the slot. And... Just your night to shoot the puck that goes in the net. He's had an unbelievable evening. Calgary's showing no signs of slowing down here in this third period of big time. Puck is dropped and we are back underway. From the neutral zone now. A chance! One save! How did he get a piece of that? Unable to reach that one. Montreal's got the puck along the wall. Offside is the call, and we'll have a face-off just outside the offensive zone. Calgary's attempt to put more pucks on net has paid off as they lead it in the third. Jonas has won the draw here in the neutral zone. Puck picked up in the open ice. 
King's going to play it against the half wall. Grabs the puck here inside the offensive end. The Flames have it against the wall. And he slides it quickly to Jonas. Here's a short pass to King. Takes control of the puck. Takes a shot. And that one's turned away. Takes it to the net. Calgary's going to play the puck from behind the cage. Into the offensive end now. Slides it across. The Stingers gain control of the puck against the wall. Calgary's got control of it now here in the offensive end. Scores! I love it. What an unbelievable play. Dangle the puck to your own feet. Finish it off. Beauty. That deserves a proper sally on that one. Kavaratsis takes it inside his own end. Slides it across to King. They've got numbers. It's a two-on-one. Oh, smart heads up play to put that one away. Under a minute to go in the third. Can't find his man. Unleashes a cannon! Brilliant save, read it perfectly. And now he angles it across. Scores! Wow! Man, you say that a lot with this guy. It's like every time he gets on the ice, the puck ends up in the back of the net. What a night. Calvary's put in one of their most complete efforts that we have seen in quite some time. Up big time late in this third. Right up front! Snaps one on net, denies him in front. Down he's taking it from his own end. Handles the puck. Takes a shot. He scores! You talk about memorable nights. This has to be right up there. Man, it's like he's in practice. Every time he shoots the puck, it ends up in the back of the net. What a game for him. Jonas wins the draw. Pokes the puck away. The Flames scoop it up along the boards. Denied by the goaltender. Loses possession after he takes a little hit. Takes the feed in the middle of the neutral zone. Passes right to the front. Here he is on a breakaway. And it is all on this one. Well, we have told two coaches tonight in the room. One high-fiving and the other early skate tomorrow. Nah, I think you'd lick your wounds after a game like this and try and rebound a little bit more slowly. I mean, punishing skates are a thing of the past. 